Hi everyone, I just released my new Udemy course Advanced Langchain Techniques Mastering Rack Applications. Three and a half hours of content that will help you to create useful high quality rack applications. The course starts with a deep dive into the Langchain expression language since LCL is the core of the new Langchain version. So that's like half an hour where you can get really comfortable with LCL. After that you will learn about the indexing API. The indexing API helps you to keep your raw data in your embedded documents on, in sync. After that, we have a look at the Ragas framework, which allows you to test the quality of your RAG pipelines. After that, we're gonna improve the indexing step by learning different chunking techniques. And also we have a look at different embedding models. After that, we're gonna explore how to improve the quality of queries for better retrieval. We have a look at multi-query retrieval and also height, which creates hypothetical answers of the document. We're then gonna explore the parent document retriever, which performs two-stage retrieval, and we even implement a custom Postgres doc store with the base store interface from Langchain. So quite advanced topic here, but I think that's really cool to learn. We also cover a little bit, not too much, agentic rack. So we cover rack with an agent, which uses an LLM and a retriever tool. After that, we cover post-processing. We have a look at re-ranking with a cross encoder model and also at the topic LLM-based document compression, where we let an LLM evaluate the documents in comparison with the uh, query. We're also gonna explore how to work with tabular data. This is all done in the routing section. Because tabular data is very bad for normal rack, so we let an LLM write SQL queries and use routing to decide whether a rack approach is now better for retrieval or writing the SQL queries is better. You're also gonna learn how to prevent SQL injection when you let an LLM write SQL queries. The next step in the course is another framework which can be used in combination with a lang chain and that is Nemo Guardrails. Nemo Guardrails allows you to prevent an LLM from performing specific tasks like talking about the politics or giving some hallucinations as answer. It also prevents users from making prompt injections. So that's a very powerful framework and you learn multiple ways to integrate that with Langchain. After that, we're gonna have a look at Langfuse. That's an open source version of Langsmith, the enterprise product of Langchain, which allows you to trace chains very detailed and I'm gonna show you how to set that up in a Docker container. The last section covers tool calling. Tool calling is an approach like RAG that allows the LLM to work with knowledge that was not trained into the model. But it's more suitable for working with external services like an API. So you're gonna learn everything about tool calling in this section. After completing this course, you will be able to create high quality LLM applications that are good enough to be used in an enterprise context. The link with a promo code for the best price can be found below in the description of the video. Thank you very much for your support.